It seems strange. I think everybody knows that punk came along to try and drive away, or it had the it had the effect of it driving away people yeah. like Emerson, Lake and Palmer. Right, yeah. I don't think people imagine that right down at unsigned level, it was having that same effect. Oh yeah, it, it right down the bottom, right down the grassroots level, it was just wiping out bands. I, I think, I think, I think there were pretty established bands like Big Front Yard in, in, in the area at the time who we were also finding it hard to get gigs. And of course the Winter Gardens and Malvern was actually running there. And of course Cherry Red were the big promoters at that particular time. And of course they were, they were attuned to what was going on as well. And I know Kevin still had bands like Thin, Thin Lizzy and uh, Hawkwind turning up. But audiences were diminishing each time I think. And, and gradually they started thinking well we're starting this punk line. And uh, there were, I think, a couple of punk gigs which came out. I can't, I can't remember the bands now, Jim. I remember the stranglers coming on, so the place was absolutely heaving. 